Welcome to Nagoya, Japan. At about 2.3 million residents, it is the fourth most populated city in the country. For this short introductional video, we'll be taking a closer look at Nako Ward, located in the heart of the city. As an urban community, you'll find this part of Nagoya bustling with people on their commute to work during the week, while enjoying the many shopping areas, museums, and art galleries on the weekend. Whether you choose to get around by bicycle, car, or bus, navigating the city is surprisingly easy and stress-free. When looking for an escape from the downtown area, you'll find you are never too far from perfectly preserved traditional Japanese architecture. Here we find Osu Cannon, which was originally built in 1333 and moved to its current location almost 400 years ago. Adjacent to the temple is a long stretch of covered chopping arcades. As each section is intertwined with the other, you'll find there are always new places to explore, whether you have a few moments or an entire day. For those looking for the perfect blend of new and old Japan, Osu is a great location with easy access by subway. More than anything, Naka Ward is known best for its shopping and entertainment districts. With enough areas to explore during the day and well into the evening, you're likely to find yourself in this part of the city no matter where in Nagoya you choose to live. One of the most popular attractions and meeting places is the Sunshine Sakai Ferris Wheel. Located on the side of an entertainment and shopping complex, taking a ride will give you a new perspective on the city. Even though very much a concrete jungle, Naka Ward has an uninterrupted green strip of public space called Central Park. Towering in the center of the park area is the Nagoya Television Tower. As a definitive point of the city, the area underneath the structure is known to host summer beer gardens as well as other performance events throughout the year. A short walk away from the tower will take you to Oasis 21, a large shopping arcade and event space that sits in front of the city's main art gallery. At the sub floor of the structure, you'll find a variety of shops and restaurants that serve everything from coffee to ramen. As a central terminal for the subway and bus lines, Oasis 21 makes for an easy transit to the city and back home. Continuing from the subway station is an underground mall that includes a variety of goods and international food stores. As you make your way through the passages to the center, you'll find the Crystal Fountain, another popular meeting spot. Back on ground level, it's only a matter of time before you find the Science Museum. Here, wedged between two main buildings, you'll find the world's largest planetarium open to the public. With a large park in front of the building, the Science Center is a great day trip to make during the weekends. Although that wraps up our short tour of the Naka Ward area, please stay tuned for the next installment. Until next time, sayonara!